how to make a total mix using slash and spread method follow me and learn so you already get your mini pattern your busy pattern you can use a mini pattern sometimes i use a mini pattern to be sure that i get my steps right or to, to document my steps so you notch the points that you want the slash and spread to be on the neckline um towards the side that so you use that to, to slash and spread and you use it to cover up the side that because you don't want the side that but you want an opening around the neck that so it starts manipulation you're moving the darts from the side that to the neck area then the other point on the neck area you move you slap and um, draw a line towards the end of the blouse and then you slash also so um, i would advise that you measure the the slash points so that they are even maybe one inch one and half inch you know the more fullness you want the more inches you will want the spread to be um style inspiration for you to you know to you know play around with and use these designs you know, to create your own unique you know, design you know, make exactly you know that blouse you want to work your workspace what we found out in so many looks are in here just take your time you know look at them and you're able to select which one you want to recreate you know for your next project if you have any more questions you want to ask concerning touch your neck you can drop you know your comments your, your questions in the comment section and you can reach me on instagram you know so that we can talk more want an elaborated um, tutorial on this you can also let me know so i'll make but here is a tutorial, tutorial and then start inspirations for you i hope you enjoy it and please let me know you can tag me when you recruit yours you can let me know you know send me the picture and we can work together on your projects